This is a historical building. Mm -hmm. Okay? An absolutely historical building in Liberia. But it's privately owned right now. I have security guards telling me I can't go in there. The gate is closed. I don't call this dude seven times just to have access. So tomorrow I have to go to his office. He got to look at me, size me up, and decide if I'm good enough to enter a property built on Liberia soil. It makes no sense to me at all. So some of us that come from the diaspora to come and make an impact and make a difference, we need access to places like this. Because these are the first place that hold the history that make Liberia wonderful. Nobody will come from America and not come up my mom's way. Nobody. But you're telling me, sir, I got to stop all of this. Look at the, 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 the unsafe path that I have to take just to be able to experience this site. It makes no sense. And this is now privately owned. Nobody in no way for me to get into this place today. And I'm pissed off. It makes no sense and it's not encouraging for me to come all the way from America and I'm not able to have access to places like this. If it's closed and not operating, I should be able to go in there and go look at what I need to look at. And there should be a better protocol. I don't have to call somebody in the living room to decide if I enter or not. Because this is not a private property. This is a government property that is leased. It's not private. So somebody should be able to be here and give me a proper way to get in and look at it and do what I need to do to better the country. Yep. So y'all please, y'all gotta do better because y'all make it hard and it's very discouraging to come from America and try to do something in this country. Entertainment wise, we need sites like these. This is what history is. This is what entertainment does for us. That's how we get inspired. And it pissed me off that I gotta come and deal with this shit in their house. So y'all gotta do better. I beg y'all. Amen. Thank you, dummy. She was talking about Dugo Palace. Here, Giselle Magazine is here. Dummy Semping is here. A few other representatives from different companies are here to have access to the Dugo Palace to do the survey and uh, inspection for the project. We all have different different projects, and they deny everybody access. There's a, I believe there's a lemonine guy we have to call, and he got to decide if we can have access to the government um, government building, Duga Palace. So we call him, and he says no. So Liberian got to turn around because a lemonine guy says no in Liberia. We don't know the procedures, but we're gonna go to tourism and get more information.